Just picked up a Filson coat. This is the lightweight dry cloth cruiser in Marsh Olive. And it comes with this little hang tag. You might think this is a booklet or something, but it's just, it's actually, it's kind of like, whoop. It's riveted, so that does actually. Got a little hidden motto for 100 years series out there in the light on the quality of toughness withstand test of time. CC Filson Company. It's funny because for me, someone who's been a Filson since the 90s, uh, you know, at some point they kind of dropped away from the CC Filson. It's good to see that CC Filson is making a comeback. Because I'm a Filson geek, probably frame this, put it at the desk. That'd be fun. Standard cruiser setup, pockets wise. So basically, boom, four pockets. Uh, just one main pocket here, uh, drop down pocket here. Now these are nice because they got. My hand's cold, kind of hand warmer pocket. I like this, this one, uh, it's got the, you know, we live in the age of little things are can be important, little memory cards, uh, or change, you know, a little, little knife, I don't know. This kind of pocket's nice. This upper pocket's standard pocket here, but it's got the tool slots and pencils. I, mean, I guess you could put a cigar if it's thin enough. For me, this jacket's all about travel, travel jacket. It's, you know, it's pretty lightweight, it's crushable. Filson has a tendency to not use zippers because I think the philosophy is zipper can break or if it does break or get jammed. Uh, if you're out, you know, in the field, hunting, fishing, traveling, there's really no way to repair that. So their snaps and buttons are more common. If one button fails, you can still secure your coat. That's their philosophy. Uh, this for me is replacing kind of like the oil, like a tin cloth or wax cotton. Um, there's just no smell to this. You know, it's dry finish. So if I'm outside all day. I don't mind that smell. Um, but if I'm traveling or road tripping, I don't, I don't like the oil smell as much. It kind of permeates the car. A nice feature that I like is the rear gain pouch. And then it's just a whole Hello there, yeah, it's just a whole pocket in the back. This thing's got a hood. Uh, it is nice, it does come off. Now the hood, I I think one drawback here, hood is unlined. They, they've got this nice accent with the corduroy, that's fine. Could have been lined, I think that would have been a little better. Some of these also have the wire to keep, this doesn't, so no inside pockets. I'm just, I, I'm just, I've got a phobia about, you know, losing stuff, getting stuff stolen. So I always like inside pocket for wallet. But you got the pockets outside, they'll, they'll do the job. Collar also lined with that corduroy. Now the entire jacket inside is lined. It's kind of that polyester lining. It's like the slip and slide for your arm, just goes right through. Again, the corduroy making an appearance. One thing that's nice about the cruiser style, it's got the full cape, so you see, Double, double material over both arms in the front, double. Fully lined on the back. The water, look at that, water will kind of beat up. It's not gonna be the most waterproof, but you can see, ooh, look at that water roll, and you can see it's gonna roll around a bit. It is a Filson, and I'm looking forward to using it. 